This will be an HTML tutorial on how to insert a Google Calendar onto a web page. I will be using VS Code in the Google Chrome Web Browser for this. Let me jump over to my browser here. Okay, I have my browser open now. This right here is what I'm going to be creating. I've deployed my uh, one of my Google Calendars to a web page here, and it's fully interactive. Uh, I could change months. I've made this calendar public. Anybody that views my web page here can view the calendar. Uh, I can click on print up here and it'll bring up my printing app. I could print the, uh, the calendar. Uh, the way to do this, I'm going to go to my uh, Google uh, calendar app. I'm going to open a new tab. I'm going to open google.com into a new tab. I'm going to go to that in the upper right hand corner. I'm going to click on this uh, square full of dots up here. This is the way that I get to Google Calendars. And then my apps are all in here. You just have to scroll through here and find Calendar. I'm going to click on Calendar. Then in the pane off to the left hand side here, you have to determine which calendar you're going to uh, deploy to the website. I'm going to de deploy this. Uh, I created a calendar named Website Calendar. Uh, if you need to create a calendar, you could just go down below here and click on the plus icon. And then you would click on create new calendar. I've already created one. Make sure that that calendar is uh, the only one that is checked. Then you want to click on this three dot hamburger menu off to the right hand side here. And you'll click on settings and sharing. Now right up top here you can see this is my website calendar. Uh, if you scroll down just a little bit, access permission for events, you want to make sure that this make available to public is checked. Make sure it's checked otherwise people won't be able to see your uh, calendar dates. Then the pane off to the left hand side you want to scroll down to where it says integrate calendar and click on integrate calendar. Now underneath Integrate Calendar, you want to go down to where it says Customize. There'll be a little button down here that says Customize. You click on that. This gives you an example of what it's going to look like on your web page. As you can see right up here, Website Calendar. That's my calendar. Off to the uh, In the pane off to the left-hand side, it gives you all different kinds of options. You can check or uncheck any of these. If I want to uncheck Title, It'll show me what it looks like without that title on there. I'm going to leave it on there. Uh, you could uh, change the width or height of the uh, calendar right here. You could also do that in, in your code editor. It gives you all different kinds of options down here. I have my holiday holidays in the United States checked also because that gives me the holidays here. You could check that or uncheck that. Uh, after you choose the options that you want, you just go up to the top up here where it says embedded code off to the right you'll see a little icon there if you click on that icon it copies this code to your clipboard then you want to jump over to VS Code okay I have VS Code open now I just have a simple uh, HTML document here just the HTML boilerplate here and first thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna go to my opening body tag right up here I'm gonna put my mouse cursor at the end I'm gonna hit enter twice just to come down a couple lines I'm gonna create an h1 and in between the opening and closing h1 tags here I'm just gonna write this is my Google Calendar Then I'm going to put my mouse cursor outside of that closing H1 tag. I'm going to hit enter a couple more times. And I'm going to paste that code that I had just copied. I'm going to press Control V to paste it. At the end of this closing iframe tag here, I'm going to hit enter a couple of times just so I have a little separation there. And that is basically all you need to do. Now, if you run this through a uh, HTML validator, it's going to throw a couple errors. Let me jump jump over to 
my validator here. As you can see, it says there's two errors on this web page. Uh, it does not like the frame border attribute and it does not like the scrolling attribute. Uh, it says to add to add them in CSS instead. You can simply remove them. You could add a border in CSS. Let me jump back over to VS Code here. These are the two attributes right here that, it's, that it does not like. So I'm just going to remove them. Like I said, you could always add them in CSS. You could add a frame border in CSS. And from here, you could change the width or the width and height of your uh, calendar. Uh, there's a million different ways you can go with this. You could uh, add a class to it. You could add a CSS file. You could place it in a div to to position it. It just depends on what you're trying to do. But this is the base. This is basically it right here. I'm going to go up to File. I'm going to go down to Save. I'm going to jump back over to my web page here. I'm going to refresh, and there it is. That is how you add a Google Calendar to a web page using HTML. Thanks for watching.